What's up everybody? This is Nomadics and today we're going to be playing some Infus. Now, Infus has a kind of a different playstyle. She gets her passive basically means if you're standing there inactive for 2 seconds, you get a damage debuff or something like that. Or wait, no. You get a you receive less damage, okay? <laughs> the damage debuff makes it sound not right. Okay. Anyways, you essentially, you take less damage, okay? Damn it, you take less damage. How about that? So, first match here, we're gonna be playing versus an Anakin. Now, I think anytime Anakin is playing against a leader that is also a melee leader, he's probably gonna be pretty happy. But, uh, okay. Done him. I think he's gonna die here. Yeah. And I think that's probably pretty good for us. We are going to run in here. Start whacking away. Just going to run away. I mean, I'm not sure why he's chasing me at this point. Okay. Let's go ahead and continue to run. We are going to draw a bomber here. Okay. Stun him. He's my special, and that should be good. I think I am going to run in here and die. I'm going to drop my, uh... Oh, I'm not going to die. Holy crap. Oh, no. Oh, worst time to die ever. <laughs> well, apparently, level 2. I did an okay damage here. Pull, kill, come on. We're not going to... We're not going to commit too much to that. I hope I don't have to bomber this, but I might. Well, looks like he did still get the damage off. Alright, we're going to drop this on the other side. Grab his health pack. Okay. Should be fine. Alright, let them get close. Use my special. Should be fine, should be fine. The stun off. I, I'm actually really surprised that that didn't hit him. Okay. Alright. Look at him chasing me down. The attempt is there. I appreciate the effort, you know, I appreciate the effort. Okay, we're gonna pop this over here. Please kill him. Perfect. Alright, and I think we are going to take out this tower. I really wanted my unique to take out his units, which is why I played it, but... Okay, just play this on the other side, so we're covering both lanes. He's running the Bantha G and K strategy, which is kind of interesting, gotta admit. You don't see it very often nowadays. <clears throat> we could kind of make him that cost him, though. Okay, let those come in, stun him, ooh, brutal, ooh, got him, not a chance, goodness gracious, that was terrible, terrible, ugly play, but I'll take it, good game, so, meh, I think Infus had a lot of potential, I mean, by no means am I running... Like, there are players that had Infus at 8 in foil, perk 5. Mine is perk 0, and she's still tanky enough at level 2 to not die from a tower when she's tanking. Like, that's... I cannot believe she didn't die. Alright, next match, we're playing against... The man, the myth, the legend. We are gonna go ahead and just make this play on him. Okay, run away, run away. All right, playing this here. Perfect. Just run in, we're gonna get some pot shots off. Unique is actually really, really good at uh, getting the, the pull again. Oh getting away definitely don't want to stand around for that I do want to let that shot get off though 
Oh, thank goodness I am playing as... Oh my goodness, please, stay alive. Got him. Pretty, pretty good thing that my, uh, I was able to stun him there. Okay, drop the stun on him again. Grab his health pack. Okay. Just continue to run away. Let's pull him away from my, my, my Bantha there. Okay, I'm playing this on the opposite side because we do have to take care of that. Again, I'm just standing here trying to uh, trying to distract him. I mean, I'm not trying to do anything. All I want to do is just kind of draw attention away. Okay, let him run in. I know he probably wants to use his special. And because of that, we're not going to come in range. Fine, if he wants to die there. That is fine by me. Run in. I'm not tanking this time, okay? I'm absolutely not tanking this time. We're not going to be that foolish. Special. Okay. I bought an extra second or two, so... Now we're just getting out of there. Emphasis is so fast, so... Can really just kind of... Take advantage of that speed. Okay, stun. Pull him. Then play this. All right, all right. We're just gonna have to tank those shots, unfortunately. But I'm pretty sure we're gonna get his health pack again. Perfect. All we're trying to do again is just prevent. We're gonna pull him away from all my units here. Oh, he's gonna die. Not before he kills me, really? That little slash, man. That slash, though. Definitely had a card level advantage, not a. Um, I mean, a six level turret disadvantage is a big deal. He's rocking nine epics, so. Not really a fair match, I would say. <clears throat> Even though I'm running 2-2, my units are just much stronger. So if I play them properly, I can kind of mitigate the fact that I'm playing at a 5-level leader disadvantage. But I will say, having a higher level leader, I think, is equally important. Not that it matters now, but, you know, back in the day when it did matter. Okay, so playing against a good old Drayden. Drayden is a freaking beast, man. But basically the way that you beat Drayden is that you, I mean, you have to hit the stun. Like, if you hit the stun, man, you're doing real good. Okay, I'm getting out of there. Ooh, really? Oh, really? All right, bomber, please do work. I ended up missing because I overestimated. I thought they were going to be closer than that. But it turns out he had to go ahead and use his rage. So that's actually pretty decent. Now, the good thing about running unique here is that I can pretty much guarantee that I'm going to get the kill on him. Okay, we are going to run in. Special these guys, just to kind of push him back a bit. Okay. Okay, we've got to just continue to run away here. Again, not an enormous fan, but I think... I might still have to kill those assassins, or did I get them? Okay. Well, I did a bunch of damage to the top with my split play, but I think pushing his units back actually ended up hurting me, maybe. So we are going to go ahead and play again for the top. Okay. Alright, special. 
Probably get the kill on him here, please. Kill him. Alright, drop the bomber, just in case. And thankfully, Spotter coming up clutch for me there. The fact that I had him play behind, and I was able to get the kill on the leader, so he couldn't actually play any units specifically to focus, is a big deal. It was absolutely a big deal. Now we are just going to counter slow play. Again, distract these little troops so that we kind of just mitigate their damage a bit. Okay. Alright, cool, cool. Go ahead and kill all of that. Spotter behind again. And, yeah, pretty sure we're in a decent spot here. Just drop this up top. Spotter, man. If Spotter gets on a tower, it's it's disastrous. It is absolutely disastrous. I mean, there's just... There's not much... <clears throat> there is no stopping it. Like, if you're dead and a Spotter is on the tower and it's not tanking, it's gonna kill it. Like, hands down. But it's just so easy to kill. I don't know if it's worth three energy, but... Uh, I guess we could play one more. You know, we'll play one more. Let's see how it goes. I've uh, I've definitely slowed down how much time I put into this game. It's definitely not. I mean, like, there's no motivation for me to like try really hard and put forth the effort because it it doesn't really mean anything now. Before it did. You know, like I could always come back to that deck later or. Or what have you. But now that is absolutely not the case. Okay, drop these on the other side. Oh, I had to drop Bomber. Okay. Let's go ahead and sneaky wassel. It's done. Ooh, I think I actually helped him there. Damn it. Congratulations, you played yourself. Because had I have not, <laughs> if I wouldn't have played Weasel there, then my honor guards would have killed him with the stun, and I would have been able to counter push. But it's all good. You know, it's all good. Wasted. <clears throat> so he's coming in again. Now, when he does come in, special. Okay. Ooh, spotter. Get him. Get him, spotter. Okay. Okay. We are going to drop this on the other side. I do want to die here. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. So, this should, in theory, do really well. I mean, I keep having to drop Bomber on the, the army there. The sniper army. But that push up top, man, oh, and he's got the freaking, are you kidding me? You've got to be kidding me. Okay, so he did go ahead and special, it's fine. We're going to have to drop this here. Have to take this out. And I think if we focus the tower, we might be able to get it. Okay, please run away. Okay. We aren't going to go all the way in there. I do kind of want to let that lock on first. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. That's perfect. I mean, Sniper Army, again, there's no way. Like, every time he plays it, I, I get value. It's like, oh, yeah, I guess I will take that positive two energy trade. I mean, I'm playing Infus, so I can always run in and special if he does decide to uh, to play something there. Okay. All right, all right. Perfect, and I think we are gonna get this other tower. That sneaky little spotter, man. Oh, so dirty. He thought he was being clever with the repair there, but didn't matter. I mean, if you are going up against a repair and you know that they're running repair, then you can always hold bomber. I think what he was trying to do was 100% bait out the bomber by playing the sniper army, but 
you gotta have a you have to have more than two cards like when i'm as infus i can just run in and special and if he's around the tower then i'm gonna stun him too i'm gonna stun any units so uh eh, not really a huge fan but i do think on krennic if you're running death squad leader and say like if he was running death squad leader instead of the executioner and if he was running the heavy gunners instead of the sniper army that deck would be way better hands down boom solve the problem but you want to make sure that you can keep your death squad leader alive and if you're running something like sniper army that's gonna get killed you have to clear it you can't leave it alive or repair you can't leave it alive type deal so anyways guys that's emphasis eh, i think she's pretty good i think i'd have to play her a lot more to get like much better with her but i would say good enough good enough y'all take care peace